Four shows coming to WWE Network and Peacock this weekend. Unthinkable alliance with Roman Reigns formed on past SmackDown, former champion interviewed. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. Four full-length shows are coming to WWE Network and Peacock credit. WWE.com WWE Network and Peacock had a pretty busy weekend last week. The sports entertainment juggernaut hosted the Bad Blood Premium Live event. In addition to that program, the streaming services also aired a countdown show and a post-show press conference. This was in addition to the standard weekend programming. The content didn't stop there, however, as more shows were added throughout the week. For example, Monday saw a new episode of Raw Talk made available. Unfortunately, Peacock fans missed out on Tuesday, as NXT wasn't added on demand, and the archives of the show were removed. Wednesday saw a new upload on both platforms, however, with a past episode of Monday Night Raw made available on demand. Lastly, a new episode of This Week in WWE covering all of the action arrived on Thursday. More content will be on the way throughout the weekend. Friday through Sunday will see four new uploads arrive, some of which include brand new in-ring action and new promos featuring top stars. Additionally, two archived shows will arrive on demand. What will be added to the networks? Below are four shows coming to WWE Network and Peacock this weekend. Number 4. The SmackDown Lowdown will be back with another new episode. A new episode of The SmackDown Lowdown will be streaming on WWE Network and Peacock. More specifically, the show will air on Friday, October 11, beginning at around 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time immediately following SmackDown on USA Network. This is a new time slot for the series, as it used to be available on Saturday mornings. With the move of SmackDown from Fox to USA, the show changed times. Interestingly, Raw Talk was an hour long this week. There is a chance that the SmackDown Lowdown will follow the same path, but that isn't yet known. For those unaware, the series features Megan Morant and Scott Stanford breaking down the action of the Blue Brand. In addition to analyzing what went down on the show, select interviews are spliced throughout. Last week's edition of the SmackDown Lowdown is available on demand, but the interview portion can be seen in the video above. Naomi, Carmelo Hayes, and Mitchin all spoke. Additionally, Bianca Belair joined Naomi mid-interview. Number 3. WWE Main Event and Number 2. Friday Night SmackDown. Two recent shows will be added on demand. Two shows that recently aired on other platforms will soon be arriving on both WWE Network and Peacock. Friday Night SmackDown, which once aired on FOX and now airs on USA Network arrives on demand on a 30-day delay. Meanwhile, main event used to air on Hulu, which led to a two-and-a-half-week delay. Now that main event is no longer on Hulu, it isn't clear why the arrival date is still delayed. WDE main event from September 26, 2024, will be added to the archives on Saturday, October 12. Two matches were taped for the show, including the Final Testament's Karrion Cross versus Alpha Academy's Akira Tozoa. The main event featured Pure Fusion Collective's Zoe Stark taking on Lyra Valkyria. Friday Night SmackDown from September 13, 2024, will arrive on demand on Sunday, October 13. This was a monumental edition of SmackDown, as it saw Cody Rhodes and Roman Reigns begrudgingly agree to unite in order to stop the Bloodline's Solo Sikoa and Jacob Fatu. Number 1. NXT Level Up Will Stream A new episode of NXT Level Up will be streaming across both Peacock and WWE Network this weekend. The newest episode will air on Friday, October 11th, following the SmackDown Lowdown. The show used to air immediately after SmackDown, but that is no longer the case. It will likely stream between 10.30 p.m. and 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. The future of NXT Level Up has been in question, but for now at least, the show will carry on. This week's edition of the series features two big matches, one of which includes an NXT favorite. Level Up typically has three matches per show. However, that changes when a few have to be filmed in bulk due to NXT's schedule requiring such. 
Beloved NXT star Tatum Paxley is set to go one-on-one -on -one with Callie Armstrong in the opening bout of the WWE program. From there, the main event will see Gallus members Mark Coffey and Wolfgang take on Cutler James and Shiloh Hill in tag team action. Four must-watch shows coming to WWE Network and Peacock this weekend. An unthinkable alliance with Roman Reigns and an exclusive former champion interview. As the weekend approaches, WWE fans are in for an exciting treat with four brand new shows coming to WWE Network and Peacock. These shows promise to deliver thrilling content, jaw-dropping alliances, and Among exclusive interviews is an unthinkable know. alliance involving Roman Reigns that has sent shockwaves through the WWE Universe, as well as a highly anticipated sit-down interview with a former champion who opens up like never before. In this in-depth, 5,000-word exploration, we'll break down each of these shows, give you the inside scoop on the shocking Roman Reigns alliance, and reveal what you can expect from the former champion's eye-opening interview. Whether you're a die-hard WWE fanatic or just love catching up on the latest in wrestling drama, these shows are sure to offer something unforgettable. 1. The Roman Reigns Alliance – The Shield Reborn one of the most captivating narratives in recent WWE history has been the dominance of Roman Reigns as the Universal Champion. Since aligning himself with Paul Heyman and taking on a more ruthless, dominant persona, Reigns has solidified his position as the Tribal Chief and undisputed leader of WWE, but in a twist that no one saw coming. The latest episode of SmackDown revealed an alliance that has left the WWE Universe in utter disbelief. This weekend, the WWE Network and Peacock will air an exclusive special, The Shield Reborn, Roman Reigns' Unthinkable Alliance. This show dives deep into the shocking events of last week's SmackDown, where Reigns appeared to forge an unlikely alliance with none other than his former Shield brother, Seth Rollins. The Shield, a brief history. Before we get into the shocking details of this reunion, it's important to revisit the significance of The Shield. Roman Reigns, Seth Rollins, and Dean Ambrose, now known as John Moxley in AEW, debuted as The Shield in 2012. The trio was unstoppable, wreaking havoc across the WWE roster with their trademark combination of power, agility, and tactical precision. Their bond seemed unbreakable until 2014, when Rollins betrayed his brothers, leading to the group's dissolution. Since then, all three members have forged their own paths to success, with Roman Reigns becoming the tribal chief, Seth Rollins earning multiple championships as the architect, and Dean Ambrose finding new heights of popularity outside of WWE. The alliance nobody expected. The events of last week's SmackDown were nothing short of electrifying. Reigns, who has spent months as the top heel in WWE, found himself in a precarious situation during a confrontation with AJ Styles and the OC, the original club. Just when it seemed like Reigns might be outnumbered, the familiar theme music of Seth Rollins hit, sending the crowd into a frenzy. Rollins, who has been in his own personal rivalry with Shinsuke Nakamura, rushed to the ring to assist Reigns. What unfolded next left fans speechless. Instead of the two locking horns as bitter enemies, Rollins and Reigns stood side by side, delivering a brutal beatdown to Styles and his allies. The Shield's signature triple powerbomb was executed once again, and the sight of Rollins and Reigns standing tall together sent shockwaves through the WWE Universe. What does this alliance mean? This weekend special will take fans behind the scenes, offering exclusive footage and interviews with key players in this newfound alliance. Has the shield truly been reborn? Or is this a temporary truce in the face of common enemies? Rumors have been swirling that this alliance could lead to a larger faction war within WWE, possibly involving the Bloodline, the OC, and other groups looking to stake their claim as WWE's most dominant force. Wrestling analysts and former WWE superstars weigh in on the potential implications of this alliance. Could this be a sign of a major WrestleMania showdown? Could Dean Ambrose, now thriving as John Moxley in AEW, ever return to complete the Shield reunion? Exclusive interviews with Roman Reigns and Seth Rollins. The special will also include sit-down interviews with Roman Reigns and Seth Rollins, who offer their perspectives on why they've come together at this moment.
Reigns remains cryptic, as always, but hints at a larger plan that could reshape the WWE landscape. Rollins, on the other hand, seems genuinely conflicted, admitting that while their paths have diverged, the bond formed during their days in the Shield has never truly been broken. 2. Legends Reunited Former WWE Champions Reflect on Their Legacy The second must-watch show on WWE Network and Peacock this weekend is Legends Reunited, Conversations with WWE's Greatest Champions. In this special, WWE Hall of Famer Stone Cold Steve Austin sits down with some of WWE's most iconic former champions for a no-holds-barred discussion about their time in the spotlight, the impact of their legacies, and what the future holds for the current generation of WWE superstars. The Return of The Undertaker The biggest draw of this special is undoubtedly The Return of The Undertaker. Fresh off his retirement, the Deadman has rarely spoken in-depth about his career, but in this exclusive interview...